Shalom Israel, first and foremost, all praise, honor, and glory to Yahweh by Hashem Shai. Double honors to the apostles and elders of the house of David. Salutations to you brothers throughout the four corners of the earth, teaching the truth in righteousness and sincerity to you Israelite foreigners. Come back home to the truth, to those that passed on serving the Lord. The dead in Yahweh Shai shall arise first. All right, uh, I'm doing this video because uh, I was just thinking, I was listening to... Uh, old old hip-hop album Capone Noriega War Report and uh and, you know a lot of that album like they they use typical five percent slang and, and the thing is the funny thing about it is if you if you listen to most of them that they're not like Wu-Tang where Wu-Tang really had a foundation in the teachings of of five percenters when you listen to Capone Noriega they, they're more about the crime aspect and, and, the, and the you know the street aspect but they use the same vernacular, you know, talk about uh, the blood suckers of the poor. So I thought about the five percenters and their teachings and the fact that, uh, you know, they, they, there, there's similarities between us and them, you know, like for them, the 5% is what we would call the elect, the one third and the, in the, in the one forty four thousand. Um, the 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 other the two thirds and the ten percent and the eighty five percent is where it gets a little sketchy because the eighty five percent are just the ones that's lost, you know, the ones that are that just have no no direction, you know, what I'm saying they're sheep. The sheep is eighty five percent, and you have the ten percent, which is the two thirds that are trying to guide us all pretty much what they're saying is 10%. You know, it's, 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 it's two thirds because what, what, what I would say, if, if you incorporate the truth into the teachings of, of the five percenters, you know, that 10% is going to bring down a whole nother I say 56 or 51% with it. No, 56 or 57% with it to make two thirds of the nation where the 5% is going to, is going to take a good portion of that 85% and bring them up the right way. You know? So in other words, you got two, two types of leaders. You got 5% and the 10%, right? You got righteous leaders and wicked leaders. And everybody out of that, so what's being divided, the Lord already knows about the five the five and the 10, right? Who's who? Um, well, the Lord knows all of them, but there's the 5%, which is the, which is the, the, the brothers out there teaching the truth. You got the 10%, which is the niggas out there uh, selling the people out and, 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 and destroying the people. And then here's, here's where it gets crazy. The 85% is going to be half of them is going to go with the 10%, right? Not half of them, actually 56, 57% of them. And then 28% is going to go with the, go with the truth. You know, so the five and the ten just represent the leadership and the people that are guiding everybody else. You know, so this is something I came up with myself. You know, I'm not trying to merge our doctrine with that of the five percenters, but I just thought about when, you know, because part of what brought me into the truth was come to find out that the the, the concept of you know, there's there's a chosen people, there's sellouts, bloodsuckers of the poor, just like Capone Noriega said in the in the song. You know, it it uh it resonates to a degree in the truth. It's just that, you know, the way we break it down is, is a little different. You know, but do the math. Like just like five percent say, do the math. You know, you break up eighty five percent, you have say roughly 57%. You have roughly 57% and you have 
it makes 85%. You know, half, uh, a certain one third follows the truth, two thirds follows lies. You know, so then, then you know, it, it just it just makes a perfect understanding of who's who and who's going to be who in the last days. You know, because honestly, the Lord is going to bring a lot of five percenters out of that shit. A lot of them five percenters ain't meant to be no damn five percenters. Like, I personally believe you got men of the Lord in Wu-Tang. And I'm not talking about killer priests. I believe he could be a man of the Lord. But I'm talking about dudes that do not entertain Israelite teachings in their music at all. You know, uh, like go, like I believe Ghostface, the type of person he is, and he's been since he came out. You know, because he he, I remember him talking about how he was humbled one time he went to Africa. You know what I'm saying, and saw kids with flies on their faces and shit, and really felt sad for them. Like that type of that's the type of person the Lord wants. Somebody like Paul, who sees the suffering of our people and wishes that they could reverse it. You know what I'm saying? Um, and, you know, things like that. Like, like a lot of a lot of their teachings are actually based in truth, but you got to also realize that in order to use, in order to spread lies, you have to use a lot of truth. And for us, as, you know, servants of the Most High, we have to go into these shits these doctrines and all these other things and find the truth out of it and show our people, listen, this part y'all right on. This is where y'all going off on. You know what I mean? But anyway, with that, I'm going to say Shalom.